Good day everyone! I am Cadet Diaz from RE21 B2 of Asian Institute of Maritime Studies. And today, I'll be showing you my homemade centrifugal pump made in DC motor. So here is my final work. Pumps never sucks. It always creates a partial vacuum by centrifugal or regenerative working principle. The earth atmospheric pressure pushes through it into suction pipe of pump once partial vacuum created by pump, then fluid gets pressurized due to the design or construction of the pump. So here is the materials that I've been used for making my own centrifugal pump with DC motor. So here is the final product. As you can see there is an inlet, this hose, casing, impeller, DC motor, outlet, switch, adapter, and also the water. As you can see there is an additives in the water for you to be able to see the process while operating the pump. So first is the priming. Priming is the first method before an operating a water pump. Wherein the priming is done for its better life. Priming refers to the process of filling the truck or piping of a pump with water before starting the process. These do not let the pump run empty space without water in starting. So now, you have to put this adapter, then switch it on. Centrifugal pumps operate by transferring energy in an angular momentum from a rotating impeller to the fluid, which is inside a casing. Fluid enters rapidly in the inlet, which is this hose, into a rotating impeller along its axis and is cast out by centrifugal force along its circumference through the impellers. The action of the impeller increases the fluid velocity and pressure and also direct it towards the pump outlet. So basically, Current in the adapter produces an energy going to the DC motor and the DC motor allows this energy to transform into a mechanical energy and in that energy goes to the impeller creates a rotational energy that makes the water goes up and reach the impeller because of the pressure inside the impeller. The water will go out to the outlet so that's why the water can able to transform from one place to another. The working principle of this water pump mainly depends upon the positive displacement principle as well as kinetic energy to push the water. And this water pump that I've made used a alternative adapter for energizing the motor of the water pump. So, centrifugal pumps use centrifugal force to create a low pressure at the center of an impeller and it also creates a high pressure at the edge of an impeller. So low pressure pulls fluid in forced by the impeller to the high pressure edge where it is forced to a hose or opening. So the spinning of impeller creates a higher velocity as stated by the scientist named Bernoulli. He stated that So each system is different. In making a centrifugal pump made in DC motor, you need to study a fluid mechanics, both dynamic and static, which includes thermodynamics, hydraulics, and pneumatics. I hope this appropriate video that you are looking for. Thank you!